Yeah, so we're on a, a about 11,000 acre piece here and uh, the goats move freely across the whole range. I mean, we're in the middle of a vast part of the island. You've got 100,000 acre game management area on the south, a couple hundred thousand acre Parker Ranch to the north, and the goats move across the entire range. You know, there's plenty of fences up for cattle, but, uh, but they can't stop the goats. They'll go through them, around them, over them, any way they can get through to whatever they want to go to. It's incredible. I mean, just think about this. Like, we traveled in that direction thousands and thousands and thousands of miles to get here. Yep. To have my paths coming from a little town in western New York to cross paths with a goat that's lived his whole life in Hawaii. And now this thing's coming home with me. This is crazy. Yeah, this time Day of year, one. super yep. dry, so yeah. we're coming into the water like that. And, yep. Yep. You know, heats up. Yep. Perfect midday yep. That's opportunity. So Mike's got it going on. Sure, nannies. Because there's goats everywhere. It's a good old nanny. Good to take that one. She's sunken in. Yeah, her, her spine's sticking out. She's got her hip bones sticking out. She's an old, old nanny. She's perfect. Great one to take for management purposes, you know, reduce the number. Well, there certainly is not an issue with numbers of goats. We're on a bunch of goats right now, so I'm just gonna slip up here, see what's up here. We're gonna be close, so hang tight. Baby. Go down right there. He's going down. Yeah, buddy. 
Woo, awesome. That is awesome. a big goat right there, man. Nice, man. That's perfect. Nice one. Oh, yeah. They're all over the place. Look at All over through here. Yeah. yeah. Nice. Yeah. Good job, buddy. We are rocking them today. <laughs> man, this is perfect, man. Oh, I can't yeah. thank you enough. Perfect. Thanks, buddy. Awesome. Wow, they can take a hit. We're using a 7mm mag up here, and these goats are 100 pounds, and uh, they're taking hits almost better than our whitetail do. So we will regularly find Look at the goats. Them. Look at the goats up there on the hill. Oh my god. Look at them. That is that's your Oh, bugger, man. Oh, man. Good work. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. Great goat. You saw him from, what, a good thousand yards? Yeah. He just worked their way up, and there. nanny's everywhere, and uh, you just got to pick through the trophy ones, and this guy knows what he's doing, so we're in good hands. You don't find that too often, but uh, life's good here in Hawaii. What do you think, Jay? Man's here. <laughs> no. Man, this is great. We haven't even seen the beach yet. <laughs> well, let's go hit it. Oh, let's do it. How's it? My name is Mike Vitusik. This is my wife Katie. And our little baby Rainy. We're Nahele Outfitters, located here in Kona, Hawaii. <laughs> we, uh, we're a hunting outfit. We guide hunts on mouflon sheep, um, Vancouver bulls, black Hawaiian sheep, Spanish goat, Hawaiian ibex, wild pigs, and we do some upland game bird hunting, a couple German short hair pointers, and some wild turkey in March. There's a lot to do here in Hawaii, hiking, beaches, hunting is just one of the fun things you can do and the Heli Outfitters does a great job bringing you out, getting some animals, having a good time, Fam real family affair. And, uh, and you know, hunting with us, you want to make it feel like you're hunting with family, hunting with friends, not like you're going with an outfitter. So we'd love to have you. Come check out the island. Hey, Rainy? Right. Yes. All right, so we're heading to the mountains this morning. That's what's, uh, it's so cool. Uh, there's so many different terrains, biodiversities here on the Big Island. Yesterday we were hunting basically sea level, right next to the Pacific Ocean. And today we're gonna go up about 9,000 feet in search of sheep. smoked in there. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Brandon, come over there quick. Good. Yeah. Awesome, man. <laughs> awesome. Yes. <laughs> Holy cow, Brandon. Amazing, amazing footage, man. Fantastic. Awesome. This one, we just happened to kind of come down and we saw him standing there feeding, made a little stock and well, the rest is... <laughs> <laughs> you saw it all unfold. There's nothing else I can say. I am just so happy with this thing. Nice. Yeah, that's Beautiful a, black Hawaiian sheep. That's the classic black Hawaiian with the rusty wool and the black face. Old Beautiful. Girl, man. He's Beautiful. awesome. <laughs> mm -hmm. you now sometimes we'll be up here on overnight hunts. They have sheep, mouflon, right here. Wild cattle, pigs, just going right through the clearing. You're sitting there barbecuing up here <laughs> after the hunt. That's pretty neat. Oh, it's amazing. Yeah. It's really great being up here for a few days, you know, yeah. Yeah. really get to settle in and yep. get the whole experience. Yeah. That'd be awesome. It would be. Oh, it's amazing. The cabin is so nice. And it's gorgeous. Yeah, you're miles and miles and miles from the nearest person up here. 
you know, you think of uh, everyone wants to do these big remote hunts. Yeah, when they're so far out, nobody would think that Hawaii is. Yeah, I mean, but it is. I mean, we are as remote as. Oh yeah. As anything, we're up at the top of this mountain. I love it. <laughs> it's our last evening sit in Hawaii. We're trying to finish it off with a big board. <laughs> Mike, you got it. Appreciate man. it, man. That was awesome. So, give us the rundown on what's what's going on with these, you know, wild boars and hogs out here in Hawaii. Sure, man. Yeah. yeah. So we're uh, we're in a town called Kainaliu, okay, which is about 1,000 feet elevation. We're in the agricultural zone of Kona, where they grow all the Kona coffee and macadamia nuts. And these pig are a pretty big nuisance for the farmers. They come in at night and eat all the macadamia nuts. Jeez, I guess. So a pig like this will eat 50 pounds of mac nuts in a night. Which, how much value is that to the people? Oh, that's a lot. A lot of for money, sure. right? Yeah. For sure. Thanks for that, Absolutely. man. Absolutely. Now, Haley Outfitters here in Kona Island, Hawaii. Finished it off with a bang, baby. Chad, thanks, man. And uh, big thanks to Mike. Get a hold of him. Book your trip. You can't go wrong. Beach one day, hunting the next two, beach the next five, whatever you got to do. So.